another East Bay night. East Bay night. East Bay night. East Bay night. When the sun goes down and the night comes around and the fog comes rolling in. When you cast for a line to go dance one time and an old friend invites you in. Hear a punk rock song, yeah, we all sing along, everything's gonna be alright. Another East Bay night. East Bay night. East Bay night. East Bay night. Hey, what's up, YouTubers? Lee John Blackmore here at Super Easy Guitar. This week we're doing Rancid's East Bay night. Let's zoom in and get straight into it. Okay, so in standard tuning, and the hardest part of the song is that first chord. Um, he plays a B minor. If you don't know what a B minor is, it looks like this, and it's a bar chord, so it's not that super easy. But you can get around it. You can either do the power chord, okay, and I'm only hitting the A and the D string, okay? And then A, D, and then we're in. If you still can't do a power chord, if you can't stretch to do power chord, then all you do is just that B note there. Okay, so you can just cheat a bit, no big deal, right? So, if you're a bit more advanced, B minor. Another East Bay nice D. So the strumming down, 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 up, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, up. So that's nice and easy, it's just fast. Another thing I noticed as well, for me personally, this song's too low, and if I try and sing it high, it was like way too high. So I'd recommend, if you're struggling to sing it as well, try the capo, you know, on the third fret, maybe. Um. He's been He's been so it's just a little bit easier to sing up there. Or maybe not, maybe you've got a really low voice. So the chords are going to be exactly the same, but just with the cap on, all right? Now for the verse, I do something slightly different to what he does on the track. So he goes straight into D. Um, when the sun comes down and the nights come around and the fog come a-rolling in. You can really hear the Irish kind of folk influence here. So um, what I start off with, just to separate it a bit from the verse, I just hang on D. When the sun goes down and the nights come around. So I just single single strokes for that D. And then A. And the fog come a rolling in. So then you can start the rhythm, you know? And the rhythm's exactly the same as the chorus. So it's down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. If you're finding that too difficult to do the down ups, you can just do this. When the sun goes down and the nights come around and the fog come rolling in. When you cast a line to go dance one time and an old friend invites you in. So I'm just doing a down, 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 down. Okay? And when we get to the end of that uh, verse, here a punk rock song and we sing along, everything's gonna be alright. Another East Bay night. So you might have seen me doing A like this. I'm just using my first finger to cover those strings on the A and I'm avoiding that top E string, okay? But I highly recommend if you're a beginner, do it the normal, normal way, okay? It's gonna sound a lot cleaner until you get strength in your finger. Now, again, at the end of the verse, it goes back to that B minor. So you can either do the power chord, like I said, or just that B note. Another East Bay night. 
So to get that accent, down, down, up, down, up, down, it just, when you hear people talking about accents, it's usually when you make a note stand out, okay? You accent it. So either by playing a bit harder or, or putting a, a different feel onto it, okay? In this case, I'm playing just slightly a little bit harder. Just a slightly bit harder. You don't have to go crazy. Or maybe if you're playing live, it'll sound cool. So there you have it, guys. Hope you enjoyed this week's lesson. Don't forget, hit that subscribe button and hit the bell button if you want to receive my weekly updates. Don't forget, you can find me over on Instagram and Facebook to send me any requests. I'll see you again the same time next week. Enjoy. Enjoy.